when an employee makes a mistake, generally they're not expected to reimburse the company for the mistake or expected to work for free to rectify this mistake. Now, this isn't the case when you're contracting. If you make a mistake as a contractor, you should be expected to fix your own problems at your own cost and provide any extra resources to get the contract or the project back on track. Or you could see your ter contract terminated early and not being able to collect the full fee. While this example is at the extreme level, I hope none of you will never have to go through this situation. There are many ways to show financial risk if you get a knock on the door from HMRC. Invoicing for the work you've completed, situations where you've had to negotiate on price, receipts for stock and supplies, any bad debts that you've had to suffer, projects that didn't turn a profit, projects that you made more profit than you expected due to completing the work early. The final tip is to make sure that your contract has a fixed price for the work and an approximate date of completion. Coming up next is part and parcel. Thank you for watching. We hope you gained some valuable knowledge that will help you in your contracting career. If you have any questions about this video or you're having any other issues, then please put them in the comments box or tweet me at Greg Dixon and I'll make sure that I respond to them in a video or a blog post or email as soon as possible. If you think others will benefit from this video, then please do share it with them. Finally, don't forget to subscribe. We've got a lot of things planned over the next few months and we would love you to be part of it.